I know, I know, it's been two weeks since I posted my last video, I've been busy guys, but I am back. We're in my temporary new filming set. You see there's my bed, and there's that thing. I don't know what it is, but it is hella comfy. Anyway, I'm back. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to be talking about Lenovo's brand new laptop. The new Lenovo 14W Generation 2, which is perfect for the college student or the person that is on the budget. Now, Lenovo's made this computer with only one color in mind. So if you're a person who likes red, sandstone, bronze, platinum, you're gonna to have to look somewhere else because this computer is only available in black. Now lifting the lid, you got a 14 inch 1080p touchscreen display. You can also go for the non-touchscreen variant if, you'd, that is, if that is your choice. But both of them have a peak brightness of 220 nits. Above the display, you find your standard 720p webcam that does come with a privacy shield. So you don't have to worry that somebody is spying on you while you're in your skivvies or in your underwear. You got complete privacy. Now on either side of the display, you got six millimeters of bezel, which according to Lenovo, remember, this is Lenovo's words, not mine, provides a much larger, more vibrant screen with wide viewing angles. Now the keyboard is not that special. It is a back chiclet keyboard with a white backlight, with white backlighting, but because this is meant for the college student and we know how irresistible those dorm parties are, you are able to, it is spill resistant. You can spill up to 360 milliliters of any liquid on here and there will be no problem. Don't test that. All right, now to the heart of this laptop. So Lenovo has decided to go with AMD, which we all know is my favorite chipset. We got the M1 and then we got AMD. I absolutely love it. So the CPU is the AMD 3015E, which is a dual core processor with a base clock speed of 1.2 gigahertz that can be turbo boosted to 2.3 gigahertz. The graphics are your standard integrated Radeon graphics. If you want to do serious gaming, yeah, man, you have to look somewhere else. Now. The RAM can be upgraded to eight gigabytes of DDR4 memory, which is a 100% increase over the previous generation one model. And you know, you can go up to 256 gigabytes of PCI SSD storage. Now the battery in this machine is not very large. It is 57 watt hours, which Lenovo is claiming you can get up to 10 hours of all day battery life. And because they tested it with Mobile Mark, we're just gonna have to take their word for it. I mean, they guarantee it. Wink, wink. But what is nice about this computer is it does come with Wi-Fi 6, which should assist you in all your e-learning needs. So you can download, stream, and video chat without any problem, without any worry that this thing will drop the connectivity. Now, port selection is standard. You've got your one HDMI, you've got your two USB type A, let's see, is it two? Yeah, two USB type A and one USB type C that is not Thunderbolt 3. And you can get all this, this beautiful 14 inch device for $334. But the question is, should you get it? Now, if you are a broke college student that needs a laptop for your day-to-day -day activities such as note-taking, studying, or even basic coding, this is your go-to laptop. I guarantee it, you won't regret it. So yeah, that is the end of my video, guys. I'd like to thank you so much for watching it. And if you like to please hit that like and subscribe button as well as turn on post notifications to be kept informed about my weekly videos. I mean, I'm nearly at 200 subscribers. I got a personal goal of getting a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. Let's accomplish it together. So until next time, guys, cheers.